What is up everyone, this is Mo Tutorials, and today I'm going to show you how to fix the Roblox error code 503 or service unavailable, no services available, right? So let's get right into this. So if most likely you're using Google Chrome or if you're using Firefox or Edge, doesn't matter. It's essentially the same thing. What you want to do is you want to get into your settings menu of your web browser. Once you're in here, you want to either search for it or look for something called privacy and security. And in here, there's usually something called clear history, cookies, cache, and more. So in here, we're not going to delete the history. That's not what's important. We're going to delete something called cookies and cached images and file. A lot of the times this error is happening because of those two specific things. So you want to check those and essentially get those deleted. So once you've done that, try to see if Roblox works for you and that error doesn't, it should not persist any longer. If it still does, the next thing you can do is in your search bar, in your windows, you want to go into something called view network connections, right? So depending on whether you're Ethernet or Wi-Fi, you want to right click into it and go into properties. Inside of it, you want to click into something called Internet Protocol version 4 and click into properties here. And then over here, you want to do use the following DNS server or uh, addresses available. So you can do 8.8.8. .8, oh, 8 .8. Oh, what am I doing wrong? Point eight, and you can do. I think it's eight point eight point four point four. Uh, you can either do eight point eight point four point four or eight point four point four point eight. I think I, uh, one of those two works. So this is usually Google's DNS server. You can easily Google it and get what the ones you want. You can use Cloudflare's, which is one point one point one point one, and alternate is one point zero point zero point one. You can try to play around whichever one works best for you. Essentially, do that. Press OK, and then try to re. You can, you can restart your computer if you want to, but you should now be able to good to go and not have that error persist any longer. So yeah, <laughs> that's basically it. Uh, if you guys still have any comments, questions, concerns, just let me know in the comment section below. More than happy for you guys out. If you guys overall like this video, please smash that like button. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe and click that notification bell. And that more tutorials out. Peace.